Now you tell me. I don't work with sorceresses. This is no job for me. What's going on? Are you about to fight? The Conclave has forbidden dueling. You can't just back out. We agreed. We have commitments to fulfill. You did take an advance on your fee. And I'm keeping it. Don't you follow me. Witcher Geralt! A sight for sore eyes you are. May we speak? Didn't expect to see you again. Certainly not here. Loch Muin is an intriguing place. For scientists especially. We've mounted a small expedition and require protection. Sounds like regular witcher's work to me. It'll cost you. We never imagined otherwise. Our employer spares no expense on scientific undertakings. You may expect a handsome fee. After you complete the task. I'll need an advance. We'd prefer to pay a lump sum at the end. Fine, but it'll cost you extra. We shan't haggle once we reach Hannah's laboratory. The sorceress has quite a budget. Quite a budget. Quite a body. I don't have much time. Let me hear some details. The sorceress will reveal everything. We're on our way to meet her. I can only say it concerns Hanna. His laboratory, to be precise. Der Henner is dead. I know a thing or two about monsters, and about sorceresses. What's this one's name? I'm sorry, but we cannot disclose her name until you agree to join us. Nice talking to you then. Cynthia! Her name is Cynthia! You won't regret it. Where do we start? We've gained access to an ancient crypt where mages were laid to rest. It's beneath that tower. Our companions await us there. We've broken through! In the right spot! Quiet. Stand ready. He killed Vanamar. And many other mages. I know who he is, Cynthia. In the same city as Philippa, and you didn't even bother to change your name. That takes balls. Philippa's out of the picture. She's been arrested. And I was supposed to die, but I didn't. Grave error. I'll make you a deal. You don't get it. You turned Triss into a cold stone. I'm having a hard time trying to figure out why I shouldn't turn you into a cold corpse. She is alive and well. We decompressed her successfully. That There were no complications. And the interrogation after she was decompressed? Because you did interrogate her. I personally supervised it. We presented the tools, gave her a few bruises, and that sufficed to get her to talk. Cynthia, tell him to shut up or I'll kill him. Silence, Adelbert. That's an order. Witcher, help me complete my mission. Help me open Dare Henna's laboratory. What'll you give me? I've read the intelligence reports. I know your past. 
There are things in there, important things you don't remember. I could force you to tell me. I don't think so. Will you torture me? We both know you couldn't. Fine. I'll help you open the laboratory. In exchange, I'll tell you all I can. Do we have a deal? Yeah. Are we likely to encounter drowners? Or a related species? Perhaps other monsters? That is how this world's built. Sewers are infested with monsters. Rats are running around with sewers. What we're looking for, anyway? Some graves, I heard. Graves? So maybe there is something in this forest. Shut your traps. Want the sergeant to hear? You've been deep shot. We've got company. Redanian bastards. The entrance must be somewhere here. If our experts are to be trusted. Der Hanna dabbled in illusions, among other things. He also experimented heavily with golems. Golems with the power of speech, supposedly. They knew nothing of poetry, but... Will you two shut up? Yes, it's an illusion. I found a weak spot. Stand back! Later and long, Lisa and Lorn, later, dear! At times I'm close. 
port. You can get my kind of feet. Though I have no needles, they say I am piercing. What am I? Careful with the answer. It could be a trap. Typical of dear Hannah. He was a genius with a penchant for mischievous jokes. Like a child. So, a couple of adults, purported experts, should have no problem solving this. Indeed, it's trivial. The answer is pain. Incorrect. No! Impossible! So many years of research together. Why did we ever embark on this? Good at riddles as a child. That was so long ago. Perhaps it's a capricious king who rewards some subjects and sends others off to war. Kind and cruel. Supportive and sour. Only lovers are that fickle. And they're occasionally thoughtful enough to give gifts. A Lady Cynthia is an expert. I'd take her suggestion if I were you. I once had a lover. She left me devastated. Or could it be love? It seems to fit. It can be kind, the greatest gift, or cruel and take its toll. It can also be blind. How about an elf? Some are kind and bring gifts, others are bitter and cruel. Do you think this is a game? Our lives are on the line here. rather well so far. Not for everybody. Someone's been here, recently. I wager we have a few more of Dear Hannah's surprises for unwanted visitors. here. Kill them!
They must have descended straight from that water. Let a Nordling. Another guardian. this through. There are nine alcoves, a fresco in each. That's three groups of three frescoes. The riddle mentions three guides above the travelers. We must examine the frescoes, seek answers there. Mm. I'll advise you about the riddle, but I will not take part in disarming the device. I've got a bad feeling about this. say it describes a serpentine dragon swallowing its own tail, which represents infinity and thus time. The hourglass likewise symbolizes time. In this case, the time of the traveler's journey. I believe it's the dragon constellation. It would be visible at night. What's more, sources on alchemy invariably portray dragons as winged, and as an accomplished alchemist, Gehenna would also be a competent astrologer. The verse must refer to the constellation. In alchemy, the winged serpentine dragon represents prime matter, an essential component in the process of alchemical transformation. The verse seems to indicate the allegory illustrating that transformation. It should be the dragon constellation. I shall take that one. What do you think of the second verse? To my mind, it speaks of the White Rose, symbol of the Order of the Flaming Rose. You see, the fresco itself resembles a coat of arms, and in heraldry, silver is rendered as white. So the Silver Lady and White Rose are one and the same. I think it describes the full moon. In alchemy, the moon represents both silver as a metal and the feminine element. The Order remains largely unknown in the South, so the White Rose seems unlikely. Every Nilfgaardian, on the other hand, has heard of the Imperial Norsica Brigade, which has the Death's Head as its symbol. The Brigade's name is female, and they say Death follows a unit. So the Silver Lady could very well be Norsica or the Death's Head. I think it's the full moon. Allow me. What do you say to the third verse? It describes the precipice, the ravine amidst mountains. An ancient rule in alchemy states, as above, so below. The vault is the ravine into which the riches of the mountain flow. We must read the third line literally. To me, it suggests the Mahakam Mountains and its mines, from which dwarves and gnomes extract many ores that are invaluable to alchemists. Those mountains are a vault in and of themselves. The verse is not literal. In many legends, towers are in fact vaults, which the hero must penetrate in order to rescue an imprisoned princess or find a long-concealed magic item. The mountain vault is the tower. The mine entrance in the mountainside. That seems logical. I'll stand next to that fresco. Let's see if we can solve this. Take your places. Count me out. I want to live. As you will.
Let's try another Damn. combination. Less. A group of travelers wandering through the dark. Three guides above them, so three were marked. At night they trailed a drake serpentine and a silver lady shining and fine. If only her visage she would deign to unfold. By day they followed a mountain vault, its riches untold. It should be the Dragon Constellation. I shall take that one. I think it's the full moon. Allow me. The mine entrance in the mountainside. That seems logical. I'll stand next to that fresco. Let's see if we can solve this. Take your places. Count me out. I want to live. As you will. Detected. No! 